As the final events of Bible prophecies are rapidly being fulfilled, the call coming from God to His people as such a crisis as this is to come up higher. Come up higher as God called Moses to Mount Sinai. Come up higher as Elijah called the people of God to come up on Mount Carmel. Come up higher because we have a high calling in Jesus Christ. Our High Calling, a devotional by Ellen G. White. Overcoming Envy and Jealousy. Let us not be desirous of vain glory, provoking one another, envying one another. Galatians 5 verse 26. Envy and jealousy are diseases which disorder all the faculties of the being. They originated with Satan in paradise. Those who listen to his, Satan's voice, will demerit others and will misrepresent and falsify in order to build up themselves. But nothing that defiles can enter heaven, and unless those who cherish this spirit are changed, they can never enter there, for they would criticize the angels. They would envy another's crown. They would not know what to talk of unless they could bring up the imperfections and errors of others. Oh, that such would become changed by beholding Christ. Oh, that they would become meek and lowly by learning of Him. Then they would go forth, not as missionaries for Satan, to cause disunion and alienation, to bruise and mangle character, but as missionaries for Christ, to be peacemakers and to restore. Let the Holy Spirit come in and expel this unholy passion which cannot survive in heaven. Let it die, let it be crucified. Open the heart to the attributes of Christ, who was holy, harmless, undefiled. The Word of God exhorts, Love as brethren, be pitiful, be courteous. True moral worth does not seek to make a place for itself by thinking and speaking evil, by depreciating others. All envy, all jealousy, all evil speaking, with all unbelief, must be put away from God's children. The Bible is full of instruction, enjoining us to show love, patience, and respect in our speech and in our treatment of one another. The love of Jesus in the soul never leads to malice and envy. The tender plant of Christ-like love must be carefully cherished. It will not grow unless it is cultivated. Heaven takes notice of the one who carries about with him an atmosphere of peace and love. Such a one will receive his reward. He will stand in the great day of the Lord. The Lord
Thank you.